Victory Lane is only one of many eye-pleasing innovations this year. And here's the goal, the Hamiltonian Trophy. The big moment has arrived, and bugler Phil Pearson heralds the horses. with the Hayes champion, Pronto Don, pulling a high-wheeled sulky, heads the all-star cast. Number one is Mr. Saunders, driven by Gene Regal. Number two, Florella Hanover, Earl Avery in the sulky. Mix Hanover with Lou Huber Jr. is number three, while number four is Little Rocky, piloted by Joey O'Brien. Number five is Sharpshooter with Harry Pinal, while Emily Fried carries number six and is driven by Flick Knight. Number seven, Lumber Along, driven by Bill Corley. Gangawa, number eight, with Johnny Simpson. Number nine is Baron Covey, piloted by Johnny Chaplin. And number ten is Funky Hanover, driven by Bobby Camper. Record Matt carries number 11 with Del Cameron. And Del's brother Dana drives number 12, McCovey. Number 13 is Sandalwood with Ralph Baldwin. And Great Lowwater is number 14 with Del Miller. We're all set now for the first heat. Shiny Couch, New York, Ohio, moves them in. Going in first, that's Mr. Saunders. Florella Hanover's in second. The gate comes forward. It's open, and they're off and crudding. Florella Hanover breaks on the lead. Sharpshooter out in the middle of the racetrack goes for the early lead. And Emily's Pride is moving across the track in the first turn. But Sharpshooter has the lead in the turn. Emily's Pride is on the move. And Spunky Hanover is four horses wide in that first turn. As they go by the eight-mile pole, Emily's Pride is on top. Spunky Hanover moving up on the outside. He's now second. Sharpshooter is now third on the rail. Mix Hanover is fourth. Florella Hanover is up stride fifth now. As they go to the back stretch, Mr. Saunders is trotting up fifth. And Little Rocky is sixth as they go to the quarter in 29 seconds. Emily's Pride leading by a head on the outside. Spunky Hanover second. Sharpshooter is third. Mix Hanover is now fourth. Mr. Saunders is fifth. And Little Rocky goes off stride as they move down the back stretch. Emily's Pride takes the lead now by a half a length. On the outside, that's Funky Hanover second. Sharpshooter is third. Up on the outside comes Sandalwood with a rush. Now six, now fifth. At the half in 59 seconds. As they move to the turn, Emily Pride still on the lead. Sharpshooter on the inside is second. For Sandalwood on the outside is fifth. Mr. Saunders is now sixth. Gangawa is seventh. Lorella Hanover is eighth as they come over to the three-quarter mark. It's Emily Pride on the lead still by a lane. Sharpshooter is second. Mix Hanover moving on the outside is now third. Sandalwood on the outside is fourth. Mr. Saunders moving through on the inside is fifth. Spunky Hanover is sixth. Gangawa is seventh. McCombie is now eighth. At the top of the stretch now, it's Emily Pride leading the field by a lane. As they move for that wire, Mr. Saunders is slipping through on the inside. Sharpshooter in the middle of the racetrack and Sandalwood. McCombie goes for the rail and right back there is Funky Hanover and here comes Gangawa. But up on the front end, it's Emily Pride with the lead. It's Mr. Saunders on the inside second now. Sharpshooter is third and Sandalwood finishes fourth. The margin is a length and the time only one fifth second off Hootman's 1947 record. The saliva test positively proved the Phillies' speed is her own. Emily Pride has started 12 times this year before today and won eight races. By Star Pride out of Emily Scott, she is living proof of the late Charles W. Fellis breeding theory. After his death, she was sold to Castleton Farm and the Walnut Hall Farm. <laughs> Gosh, I wish I owned her.